Let's make it rain. Now, in order to alleviate drought conditions, scientists across the globe have been doing what they can to make it rain. And this is actually a real process that has been around for decades. This is known as cloud seeding, and it was first developed by chemist and meteorologist Vincent Schaefer in 1946 while he was working right here in the area at General Electric's research laboratory in Schenectady. And this is where he first seeded clouds in the Berkshires with dry ice. So how exactly does this work. Now, cloud seeding involves adding various chemicals to existing clouds in an attempt to increase the amount of rain that they produce. Now, using airplanes, drones, or ground-based generators, various chemicals, one of the most common ones being silver iodide, are released into selected clouds. These chemicals then act as cloud condensation nuclei, mimicking the dust or salt particles and adding to the number of particles that water vapor can condense onto within the cloud. Now, these droplets then grow as they bump into one another, and eventually they will fall as rain. Now, although cloud seeding has been happening for decades, it is difficult to determine exactly how effective it is because no two clouds are the same, and we are unable to know how much rain that cloud would have produced by itself before cloud seeding. I hope you enjoyed this video. For more fun, engaging explainer videos, be sure to check us out at WNYT.com FWE. Thanks for watching.